What's up, Multiverse? Dr. Dave here. Welcome to the Geek Lounge. Today's video is the latest in our series of Naruto Kaio unboxings. That's right, I will be opening up at least one of every Naruto Kaio product I could get my hands on in a series of videos to close out the year. So if you guys are fans of this product and enjoy these unboxings, do me a favor and go ahead and smash that like button as well as subscribing and enabling those notifications to join me on this series. And as always guys, a little bit of information on these cards on these sets, you can also find some useful links in the description below. So these cards are an officially licensed product in China, licensed by Pierrot Studios, the animation studio behind Naruto, Boruto, and other popular animes such as Bleach, Black Clover, and Tokyo Ghoul, just to name a few, and are produced by a company called Kaiyu. These awesome looking cards started releasing back in April 2021 and new sets continue to be made in a varying degree of tiers and ways with different cards and pull rates dependent on the set you buy. If you guys would like to know more about these amazing cards, for instance, which box belongs to which wave and or tier, the cards you can pull in a particular box, the rarities, pull rates, where you can purchase the cards and much, much more, head on over to Facebook and join these two groups, the Kaiyu Naruto Card Collectors English Group set up by BAM Collectibles, as well as VTG's Kaiyu Library set up by VTG. TG collects for a treasure trove of information as well as to meet other collectors within the community. And without any further delay guys let's switch things around and open this up. Alright so what we have here guys is the first of the blister packs. Blister pack tier 3 wave 1. There are currently 6 available at the time of filming this. This is the very first one tier 3 wave 1. They are only available in tiers 3 and 4. Currently tiers 3 wave 1, 2 and 3 and tiers 4 wave 1, 2 and 3. As I said this is tier 3 wave one that was probably a lot of tears and a lot of waves there so I do apologize if it was a bit confusing you do get a unique exclusive card to these sets but I will talk about that in just a second this particular one tier 3 wave one there I go again with those words has Naruto in his six uh, six path sage mode there it's because it's like a taller uh, type thing it doesn't really fit all in the shot here but you can see the Kaio logo there a nice kind of like hollow uh, shininess to the box as well but yeah they do just come in these packs with a bunch of the legal jargon on the back all in Chinese Naruto Naruto Shippuden and Boruto as well as the Pirot Studios logo as well so yeah guys I've got my scissors here handy let me just chop this open uh, actually I should also say there are four uh, booster packs I think it's four anyway one two three four Four, yeah, unless there is another one hiding in there, but I, I'm pretty sure it is for no idea uh, what you actually get inside of these booster packs. I don't really know too much uh, on the, well, I'm calling it a boost pack. I guess it's more like a blister pack, right? That's technically what it is. Don't know what you can get in these packs. It's the same with the X packs. I don't really have too much information on either of these, but I babbled enough. Let's open this up. Right, so it is indeed four packs, as you guys can see here. We'll just place those down there. I am going to actually draft in this youth scroll box here because it does look pretty cool we actually opened this up maybe a month or so ago now we do have another one to you know as part of this series of videos but I figured it would make you know a good visual to then prop up any of the like good hits that we get in this box but before we open up the packs guys I did mention there are exclusive cards to these blister packs and it is these LR cards. There we go. It goes into focus where you guys can make that out. This one here is Sasuke. Now, I did actually notice when I was looking at the bottom, I don't know if you guys can make that out. This actually says LR number two. So yeah, I'm not actually too sure if this was then the first blister box to be released. I guess we may find out when we get to uh, tier four wave one, which will come um, in a couple of videos time. But um, yeah, it, it says LR002, as you can see there on the bottom but yeah these are really cool I do like like black and gold they like complement each other so well there is obviously this kind of hollow shine to it as well but yeah as I said as well six of these currently available and I think I have heard that more are on the way all right it's now time to get into these packs we have the same Naruto sixth past sage artwork here on the pack like I said I don't know what to expect in these uh, whether you get anything too special, I don't really know much about these cards at all. I think I am seeing a Shizune there. I am indeed. So it is just the regular and they are actually hollow, as you guys can see, not like the tier one boxes. So I've seen a lot of people kind of go up 
So maybe we'll do the same. So we have a Neji there. Never remember those guys' names. We have an SR again. I never remember his name either. And ah, so is that what it is? Chibi cards at the back as well. So we have a Chibi uh, TGR of Minato and then just an SR. I have to say, I kind of felt there may be something a little bit better here, but yeah, we still got three packs to go. And let's waste no time then getting into that second pack. So we have another one of those Sound Ninja guys. I really should. It's not that I don't know their names. I just kind of forget and like I should have like a, a dictionary or like a Pokedex, like a Naruto Dex uh, sort of next to me. But yeah, we have him. We have Ten Ten. There's a Sakura there, so I'm guessing this is going to be a Chibi. You know what? I think I saw something nice there. So we've got a Chibi there of Naruto, a TR, with his uh, hands behind his head. So what is our main pool going to be? It is an AR card, as you guys can see there. It is AR Silver Hidan. Oh, that's really, really cool. I don't have this card. Hidan was one of my more kind of favorite characters. In, uh, in the Akatsuki, I like my uh, my villains loud and brash. And this, as you guys can see, is one of the silver ones, which are rarer variants than the gold ones. I don't know why, because like gold is kind of more than silver, right? But yeah, the silver ones are supposedly rarer. Yeah, that's really cool, Hidan. Don't have that one, very, very happy with that. All right, here is our third pack thing, guys. So I'm seeing a young... Uh, Shikamaru to start things off with. Sigetsu, Sigetsu, I always struggle with pronouncing his name. So we have Akiba there. So our chibi card at the back is of Sakura. I, or maybe I do have a Sakura chibi card. I, I couldn't really uh, remember. And then at the bottom here, oh, we've got a UR, guys. UR number 13, if you know what that is. It's a UR of Naruto with Kuruma. Really cool, the URs of the Jinchuriki with their tail beast. Very, very cool. Very happy to get this one. I do only have one so far. What do I have two? I think I did get Gara with um with Shukaku. And I think it was... No, no. I've already kind of forgotten who it was. Uh, Han. It was Han with Se Seikon. Seikon, however you pronounce that. I think they're the three I've got so far, but yeah. Uh, or I should say two. This is now the third one I've got. Very happy with that. Naruto and Kurama. All right, final pack then, guys. Like I said, there is only four. Can we still finish on something cool? We had an SR in our first pack. We had a silver AR in our second and a UR in our third. Uh, we'll probably get something terrible in this fourth pack you watch we won't finish on a bang but let's hope so so we have Hinata there <laughs> these sound ninjas they keep coming up I should learn their names so we have Kankuro there our chibi card then I'm just trying not to reveal the card behind there we go is oh my god again another um I think it's a yeah sound ninja because we have the sound uh, logo, emblem, whatever you want to call it there at the bottom. Yeah, I, I could spend all day trying to remember that guy's name. So, our final card then, guys, it is an SSR. Okay, so it is higher than an SR, but not as high as the UR or the AR. And it is an SSR of Hinata in her younger days, I think. I think I do have this one. I'd need to double check. But yeah, it's still pretty decent. And well, there we go, guys. Short, but very, very sweet, at least in my opinion. We have the LR of Sasuke that came with this set, the Silver AR Hidan, the UR of Naruto and Kurama, and we also got the SSR there of Hinata. We did get an SR. Uh, I can never remember the guy's name. He fought Shino when he was reanimated, one of the bug guys. Uh, part of the Abarami clan. I do believe those were the chibi cards that we also pulled. So yeah, like I said, short but very, very sweet. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If so, be sure to give us a thumbs up and drop some comments below. Have you guys opened up these blister packs before? And if so, 
what pools did you get? And as always, we have plenty more content coming for you guys. Our next video in this series will be opening up the tier four wave one box, which I cannot wait to get into this to see what cards we pull. Make sure you stay tuned for that and more. What is the easiest way to stay tuned? It's very simple, subscribe. Hit the subscribe button appearing now below your screen. Over on the left, you can check out the tier three wave one box if you haven't already. Otherwise guys, thanks for watching today's video and we will see you on the next one. Peace out, nerds.